Thanks for having me. All right, so I don't know what I don't know what to make of it. We're talking we're talking about keeping our gear clean. Why is this your passion? Because there's there's a lot of options out there. So I'm just gonna say this. I love my mother, but when I was a little kid, I had the uh, auspicious uh, pleasure of being at a school that had red and white colors, and my mom was everything colors and whites in the washing machine at the same time. So when I was in eighth grade, I went to my mom. I'm like, Mom, you're done. I'm like, I'm doing my own laundry from now on. I didn't want to have pink underwear and t-shirts anymore. And for some reason, she didn't have a problem with that. But anyway, I've been doing my laundry since I was a little kid. And then I noticed about six years ago, I was walking down the grocery store aisle, going through my typical ritual of opening up all the bot laundry bottles and smelling them and finding the least offensive smelling one I could find. I'm like, this is ridiculous. Why am I forced to buy products that are basically 1950s housewife products? Why hasn't anybody created a line of products that will get the guys smell out of stuff, that are really heavy duty, that get guy stains, et cetera, that also like cater to a men's branding and sensibilities and all that type of stuff. So if you look at all the advertising right now on, on TV and all the cleaning products advertising, there's a lot of guys in them. I was like, somebody's gonna do this. And I'm like, you know what? I'm doing it. So that's why I created the line. I love it, I love it. First of all, I love this because you saw a problem, you had this problem, and you found a way to solve it, and I'm a big believer that the profit's in the problem, or in the problem solving, right? And that's exactly what you did. Absolutely, so I think right now, if you look at the cleaning products world, the stain wars are over. Most cleaning products get stains and dirt. Odor's the big problem right now. The moisture wicking material everyone wears, their workout gear, their boots, their work gloves, they come back from a construction site, they're all their stuff stinks. All the cleaning products out there are not good on odor. We have a cleaning products line that's very specifically targeted to getting odor out of stuff. We have a patented uh, malodor technology that gets male sweat odor out of laundry. Specifically male. Male. So if you look at male sweat, it's chemically different than female sweat. It smells different, it behaves different in clothing and gear. So we have a patented technology that neutralizes that odor on everything. And we have three, or three different delivery mechanisms for it. One, our laundry detergent. Um, our laundry detergent is a beast. You know, it's got six enzymes, it gets all the stains and dirt out, but it's got that malodor technology in it that neutralizes male sweat odor in all your gear that you wash in it, um, which really makes it one of the only real true two-in-one sport and everyday laundry detergents out there. We also have an odor eliminating spray. This is our best selling product. It's, it's a Febreze type product, but it actually works. Um, it, it's got that malodor technology in it, but it also has a microbe. It's an antibacterial. So you spray it on your gloves, your shoes, your workout gear, your belts, your straps, floorboards of your car. It gets rid of the odor, but it also creates an environment that got bacteria can't grow. It's, really? Uh, it gets rid of the bacteria, it gets rid of the odor, and keeps the bacteria away. It's a really cool product. And then we have an all-purpose cleaner. Just a surface cleaner. We made it guy easy. One bottle, clean every surface. Has that malodor technology, so if you're cleaning your bathroom, you know, benches in your gym, anything like that, gets rid of the odor. It also gets rid of dirt and stains, but it has a, 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 um, a low streak cleaner in it so it doesn't leave a film. So you know those films that all the right. cleaners have? Doesn't leave that. And then we got addition hand soap as well. And our final product is addition hand soap. Learned a dirty little secret about the cleaning products world. Addition hand soap, it's pretty much the same product. So you just <laughs> put it in one bottle. So you have one bottle on your, on your, on your uh, countertop. Wash your hands, hypoallergenic. It's great for dishes, cuts dirt, grease, all that type of stuff. So essentially we formulated this line to be guy easy, least number of products you need to clean everything, but really focused on odor, getting rid of odor, which is a, one of the reasons of why we're here because these guys stink. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, and I can attest to this because all of my gym clothes, no, right out of the laundry, my wife says, it still stinks. Ah, so dirty little secret about the moisture wicking materials out in the marketplace. If you wear those moisture wicking garments one time and then let your sweat dry in them, they're ruined. Really? You're not going to get that smell out. So we've created this technology specifically for that issue. It's like nobody talks about it. It's fascinating to me, but that is a really crazy, like if you're wearing those gear, wear it in the shower, rinse it out, because it's going to help in the long term. Or you can wash it in our detergent. Better option. <laughs> so one of the Better. other things we want to talk about also is we're very tied to the military. We did 7% of our proceeds to the Iraq and Afghanistan veterans of America. 
we hire vets. We've got a couple of our guys running around here. They're all Army. Um, so it's a big it's a big thing for us. So we also want to be a company that uh, we're giving, but we're also supporting. So we want to bring these guys in, part of our family, um, and really support them as a company. You know, that's fantastic. Uh, Arnold has uh, a big rule about giving back to the community. He says you have to give back. It's part of being successful. And I think that our military families are often overlooked. Often. Frequently. I think it's a... From the government to the Absolutely. to our citizens, we just forget they're there. It's. I think it's. Yeah. It, I think. I think anything we can do to help the military guys is, is fascinating. Yeah, we were out to dinner with these guys last night, just sharing war stories, etc. You talk about what these guys have been through and what they sacrificed. It's. I think more companies should do more for these guys, support them as much as they possibly can. So. Absolutely, I agree with you. Our government isn't doing enough. In fact, you know the uh, what do you call it? The Veterans Administration is a mess trying to get your claims. Uh, process your benefits it's a hassle they need help yeah and so one of the things the, the charity the IAVA that we work with their main focus is PTSD they have 24-hour helplines etc and it's one of the main things that our government does not support very well they, they write prescriptions they don't really give these guys counseling um, which is not the right way to fix that. So the IAVA guys, great organization, post 9-11 uh, veterans organization, very focused on PTSD. They have great programs and services. They have call centers that you can call if you need some help. Uh, it's a great organization. We're happy to be part of that family. I love it, I love it. Hero Clean, where, where, where is the website? Where can pe uh, people find out more about you guys? So you can find us at hero-clean.com. It's our website. We're also launching nationally at Target in April. We're going to be in Ace Hardwares this summer across the country. You can currently buy us at uh, Amazon, Jet.com, uh, heroclean.com as well. And then you're in the Northeast, we're at all the Wegmans. I love it, I love it. Mike Eaton, I, I, I love this dirty business that you're cleaning up. Yes, stinky boy syndrome. We're a great solution for it. Check us out. Absolutely, Mike. Thanks so much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. You bet.